I'm Sophia Stefano here for Box to Box here at the Anthony Joshua versus Charles Martin press conference. It's the final press conference. We are two days away from the IBF heavyweight world championship fight. Anthony, we are two days off, I want to say the biggest fight of your life, the most important fight of your life, but I guess every fight has been so important to this place. Yeah, every fight's a risk, every fight's important, and every fight in front of you is just as important as the next one. So right now, we've got Saturday to deal with, and that's why it's the forefront of what I'm uh, building up to, my nerves are ticking towards, my energy's building up towards. So yeah, it is an important night, but at the same time, I'm just trying to keep a lid on it, man. I mean, you've always maintained that the fact that there is a world title on the line, you are trying to disassociate the two. One is, it's just a fight to you on Saturday. It's an opponent you respect. He's come over. As it gets closer and closer, are you still able to differentiate the two, to separate your emotions? Yeah, man. Yeah, even looking at the title so close, it doesn't mean no different to me. Um, I've, I've managed to capture some big titles when I was at amateur. I've managed to capture a couple of titles that led me here as a pro. And this is just going to be part of the history and part of my legacy. So I'm chilled, man. I'm just here to do a number on Martin because more so about the title, they're more so interested in how I perform. Do you feel, obviously, coming off the back of a fight where it was quite emotional and it was a British title, you know, some people are thinking, oh, OK, you know, let, let's see how he fares in the next fight, stepping up a level. Yeah, man, 100%. You know, that fight, I beat a man at his own game. You know, I swam waters I didn't need to swim, but now I know I got that in the locker. I feel confident going into the Charles Martin fight. I know how to ride shots, take shots, defend to the body. We displayed, I always wanted to display some stuff that I've never been able to display in my last 14 fights. So moving forward with this fight, I feel confident and I feel good to be able to do some tricks and body work and so on on Charles Martin. I know you always train like an absolute machine. We've obviously seen the behind the ropes of both of you. You both had very hard training camps. Um, I guess the only slight difference is the fact that he's the first southpaw, so you've been picking up more uh, sparring with southpaws. Yep, and that's credit. You know, we take any fight, southpaw orthodox. It'll be a tough night's work. But as you said, the benefit that we've had is definitely sparring partners, man. People that have come over from Europe and America that have stuck with us throughout camp and made life a lot easier ahead of Saturday night. O2 is your home, it's, it's your world, it's your stomping ground, the fans are the best fans in the world when you come out there, you know, goosebumps on the back of the neck for everybody, not just including you. Do you think it's going to be, you know, a lot of boxers say, in the end of the day, you get in a ring, it's two boxers, it's two fighters and we just get on with it. Can the fact that it is going to be such a hostile atmosphere for him, will it make any difference, do you think? I believe so, because I believe, like, Everyone's going to do things differently, so I can't really speak for Charles Martin, but speaking for what I've experienced at the O2, I don't know about anyone else, but when I walk out with other opponents, it's daunting. Everyone stands up, everyone's just looking for these two animals to come together and draw blood. And I don't know if he's experienced that before, he seems very calm and relaxed, but it's hard to stay that way. So it'll be very interesting to analyse how he deals with things. And if he doesn't do with it well, it does lead to a dangerous opponent as well, because he'll be boxing out of his character, and that's the man I've been watching for the last 10 weeks. So, as I said, he's never boxed in an arena like this before. It'll be interesting to see how he acts, because the man I've been studying is the cool, calm and collected Charles. And when he comes out to 20,000 people, it might be the Charles Martin, I don't know. Well, talking about cool, calm and collected, I've interview, interviewed you before every single professional fight. I see no difference. You're cool, you're calm, you're collected, you know, there is so much hype surrounding this. The whole country is behind you, yet pressure doesn't seem to sort of get to you at all. You know me, you know me. Um, I've got my family around me. Um, I've gone through so many different life experiences, you know what I mean? And I've just had to deal with it the best way I can. So it's just like this, this, this all gets shut down after Saturday and the stuff that I go through just keeps on rolling so I can't let this daunt me or you know take control over me when I've got so much other stuff to deal with on my day to day so um, this is just this is nice this is nice for me man this isn't daunting this isn't anything negative or po this is just a nice positive experience for me right, I've got to ask you something from obviously box to box you very kindly <laughs> lent us your belts yeah, yeah. which we need to return before Saturday oh, yeah, by yeah, the way yeah, 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 um, yeah, yeah. but any danger of bringing on the third one to box to box that's true you know I've got you know I've got box, box to box back all day anything you guys need 
you know, Sophie's a girl. We, we won the IBF title and you on the show. So soon. Let's get this out of the way. And Sunday night, I'm a free agent. All right, well, listen, all the best from us. Thank you so much for talking Thank to us. And uh, look forward to uh, you raising that belt. Thank you very much for having me, guys. And uh, I look forward to coming into the show and speaking to you live in the studio.